How amazing do you think it would be to sit in a car that reflects the possibility of future technologies? From the unique tech gadgets to unmatchable interior and exterior and so on. Stay tuned if you don't know which supercar we are talking about. In today's video, we are discussing the Mercedes EQS SUV, the latest luxury SUV on the market. Kindly stay tuned to the end of the video to see what this future tech is all about. Thanks! Many people are familiar with Mercedes Electric Benz flagship, the EQS luxury car. Later this year, there will be a second model, but this one swaps out the sedan's low lean design for an SUV. The Mercedes EQS SUV appears to have the same features as the standard EQS, but in a larger package. It has a long range, a powerful engine, and all of the luxurious features you'd expect from a Mercedes Benz vehicle. To compete with rival luxury electric SUVs, like the BMW iX and the Tesla Model X, Mercedes will require this technology. Let's check it out. Design and interior of the Mercedes EQS SUV. With its huge size, the exterior design is identical to the normal EQS sedan, but in a different form factor. The headlamps and false grille stand out at the front, although they've been extended out further this time around. On the other hand, the form resembles the Mercedes EQC, another electric SUV from the German automaker. There's no official drag coefficient rating, so we can't say how streamlined the EQS SUV is, but it does look a tad sleeker than the normal standard EQ. Mercedes has hinted that it could be the company's most aerodynamic SUV. In addition to being 16.8 feet long, the EQS SUV measures 6.4 feet wide and 5.6 feet tall. Under 50 miles per hour, the height can be raised by 25 millimeters. When the vehicle is traveling at over 68 miles per hour, it will lower 10 to 15 millimeters to minimize drag and increase efficiency. The EQS basic model's 10.5 foot wheelbase applies here as well. EQS SUV comes equipped with a 12.3 inch digital instrument cluster and a 12.8 inch portrait information display. As with other Mercedes EVs, the car will have the MBUX operating system, Hey Mercedes voice commands, over the air software updates, and an optional AR heads up display. The Hyperscream display incorporates a 12.3 inch gauge cluster, a 17.7 inch infotainment display, and a 12.2 inch passenger display beneath a single pane of glass for those who choose the EQ. 580 model. Virtually the whole length of the dash is covered by hyperscreen, which requires 24 gigabytes of RAM to run. In the rear, Mercedes has included touchscreen displays and a fold-down armrest with cup holders for passengers. However, anyone expecting to sit in the middle seat will be unable to do so. In addition, there will be an optional third row of seats that will allow you to accommodate up to seven passengers in this vehicle. This configuration provides 6.8 cubic feet of storage space, but the five-seater version provides a massive 31 cubic feet of storage capacity. The hood of this Mercedes EQ doesn't have a trunk, as do those of other EQ models. Performance and range of the Mercedes-Benz EQS SUV. A single motor rear wheel drive EQS 450 Plus and a dual motor all wheel drive EQS 450 have been confirmed to go on sale. Both vehicles will have 355 horsepower and 419 pounds per foot of torque and 590 pounds per foot of torque. Additionally, the AWD EQS 580 formatic with 536 horsepower and 632 pounds per foot of torque will be made available by Mercedes-Benz. The RWD 450 Plus model is predicted to have a range of between 333 and 410 miles per the WLTP testing cycle, which means it will have a top speed of between 0 and 60 miles per hour. Between 315 and 381 miles of range are possible with any 450 formatic or 580 formatic models. In light of the 453 mile range in Europe, 
Europe and 350 miles in the US EPA test cycle. It is expected that these values will change in the future. The EQS sedan's 107.8 kilowatt battery powers all variants and a 200 kilowatt rapid charging technology is available for recharging to get from 10% to 80% in 31 minutes, Mercedes claims. There is an optimistic outlook for the Mercedes-Benz EQS SUV. EQS is an essential model for Mercedes-Benz because it is a sport utility vehicle. Not only is it the company's first all-electric SUV, but it is also a new flagship EV and a roomier alternative to the EQS sedan. The EQC's delay has put a lot of pressure on the EQS SUV to compete in the highly competitive SUV market. There's still a lot we don't know, including pricing, but so far, things are looking good. Mercedes appears to have hit all the right notes. All the features you would expect from a high-end electric vehicle are included in the EQS SUV, which is both luxurious on the outside and amazing to look at within. Connectivity and Entertainment The EQS SUV employs the same 107.8 kilowatt battery pack as the EQS sedan, which is EPA rated at between 340 and 350 miles of range. Mercedes has not verified range estimations for the SUV. We expect the SUV's estimated range to be a little bit lower because it is less aerodynamic and potentially heavier. In 31 minutes, Mercedes claims the EQS SUV can charge from 10% to 80% of its capacity using a suitable DC fast charging station. A 56 inch hyperscreen for Mercedes can span the entire width of the dash in the EQS SUV for maximum theater. There is also a 17.7 inch touchscreen for infotainment as well as a 12.3 inch touchscreen for the passenger in addition to the gauge cluster. The novelty of the glass covered dash is undeniable but we can't help but deplore the near total absence of physical switch gear. A 12.8 inch portrait style touchscreen and a digital gauge cluster are still available for those who don't want the hyperscreen, wireless Apple CarPlay, an Android Auto, a Burmester audio system, and wireless device charging will be standard on all EQS SUVs. Safety Adaptive Cruise Control, Hands-On Lane Centering Steering Assistance, Blind Spot Warning with Collision Intervention, Automated Forward Emergency Braking with Pedestrian and Cross-Traffic Recognition, and more are included in the EQS SUV's standard driver assist package. All of the vehicle's driver assist technologies work together in a standard parking package to monitor the surroundings, autonomously steer the vehicle into a parking spot and alert drivers of possible collisions if necessary, and limit the driving speed to a predetermined speed. In addition to standard heads-up display, the EQS SUV's augmented reality display features three dimensions dimensional visuals. Drivers will be reminded to check the back seats with a new safety feature called Occupant Presence Recall. Price and Availability of the Mercedes-Benz EQS SUV the Mercedes EQS SUV's price has not yet been announced, but it is estimated to be in the range of $110,000 to $130,000 in the United States. It's worth noting that the EQS sedan is priced at $102,310. The EQS SUV is expected to go on sale at some point this year, although no specific date has been set. As a result, it will be the first Mercedes-Benz electric SUV to arrive in the United States states following the EQC's extended delay. Thanks for watching the video and kindly subscribe to the channel, like and leave a comment saying I subscribe and I'll personally reply to your comment. Thanks!